Good morning, everybody. It is the final days before I leave for Michigan for the Midwest Chaos Writers mini retreat. Um, it is Monday, July 8th. I leave Thursday afternoon. Um, I have a bulk of my countdown vlog um, nearly edited. Um, and I'm going to schedule that for later this week. So I wanted to take you along on the final few days. Um, so I guess this is the part two of the countdown. And then um, I'm getting into the trip. I honestly don't don't know how much footage I'm going to get. I'm going to try and get as much as I can. Um, it's going to be hopefully easier this time around because when we were all together in May, um, our focus was the kiddos and uh, so I didn't want to have Peanut on screen like the whole time and I know that like Haley has um, doesn't want to keep her kids on screen. Um, so, uh, yeah. So, um, since it's just going to be like the three of us this weekend, um, I plan on getting plenty of footage and of our, like, exploring and everything. So... Um, I am actually pulling up my, um, Obsidian, and I'm going to be working on my breakdown of everything that I need to do this week to prepare, um, because it's easier to give myself a checklist, um, and a task list that I can just click off and everything is good. So, um, I'm gonna set my phone down and record that, and I'm gonna work on editing and anything else that I can get done before this court gets out of bed. Um, it's almost eight o'clock. Uh, she has had allergy sniffles. Um, I think it's allergies. It might be a summer cold. I don't know. Um, But, um, but yeah, she, she started sneezing like crazy on Friday after 4th of July fun. And then she actually woke up Saturday morning and was like, I don't feel good. And she was just all stopped up and congested. So, yeah. Um, so I don't know how much longer she's going to be asleep. So take advantage of this time and get some work done. So here I am making my 
caramel rice crispy treat dessert that was a summer staple when I was a kid. It's just big marshmallows dipped in caramel and then rolled in rice krispies. And I wanted to make something that was sweet and fun and easy to travel with, so here we go. And don't mind my kitchen, this was recorded right after dinner, so it was a little bit hectic. <laughs> In a double boiler, I am putting together a pack of caramels, sweet condensed milk, and butter. And I'm melting that all together and then I'm going to dip the marshmallows in. It's a very time consuming process and I actually bump up the melting portion to 30 times speed just to breeze through it. I'm just getting everything out and setting up the double boiler and yeah in goes the butter and you can see let's hold it real quick um, all of the ingredients all together Now that the caramel is to the consistency that I want it to be, I can start getting ready to dip the marshmallows. And the one advantage, or the one rather disadvantage of using a metal bowl is it gets hot. So <laughs> good idea holding the bowl with a pot holder so you don't burn yourself. As I said before, this was a summer staple. It's easy to make, but time consuming. Um, my grandmother made this for us every summer when we were kids, and I've made it for family gatherings. Um, Cocoa Krispies work just as well. Um, if you want an even higher concentration of sweet. <laughs> um, so sometimes I'll make both. I did have some leftover caramel, so I probably could have used two bags of marshmallows, but there's only three of us going on this trip and I didn't want to have like a ton of leftovers. So yeah. Also I've learned in the past that if you're going to try this recipe, make sure you use sweetened condensed milk. I accidentally used evaporated milk one time and it made it not the right consistency at all. It was way too thin, the cereal didn't stick, and it was also accidentally the evaporated milk that my mom was using to make pumpkin pie, so I had to go to the store the day before Thanksgiving and replace it and get the right can. So. Don't make my mistake. <laughs> my grandmother was also a stickler when it came to name brand things. So she had in her recipe capital letters and highlighted that these had to be craft caramels. But any kind of caramels works. Um, so yeah, <laughs> as long as they melt good, you'll be fine.
I asked my husband to get out a different container for me to finish up the last half of the batch and my daughter was standing on her little step stool off the side of the counter so we were playing a little math lesson and she was counting down as I was using up each marsh marshmallow and it, it uh, she got to feel like she was helping as she was supervising and she was asking questions about what I was doing and it was really fun to have her like be a part of it and watch it and when she's a little older she'll be able to make these with me. Since someone was such a good helper, she gets the last marshmallow. <laughs> Is that good? Yeah. You're gonna run laps around the house now to run up, burn off all that sugar? <laughs> Here's the final result. I'm gonna let the caramel cool a little bit. And then I'm going to put the lids on these containers and put them in the freezer until Thursday. Hi everybody, it is Tuesday, July 9th, and I've got two more days until I leave. And it's about seven in the morning, my kiddo is still asleep, and I'm playing with makeup, <laughs> because I feel like it. I have this palette I bought last year for Run Fair, I hardly ever use it. Just look at how pretty these colors are. And so I have been trying to play around with different color combinations and um, just trying to have a little bit of fun. <laughs> Do green day. <laughs> um, so more days left until I leave. I decided to go ahead and make my Rice Krispie treats last night. So that was a lot of fun. I put up um, a version of those clips over on Clock App, um, which you can find through my link tree. I um, also have the clips on this vlog. Um, but that was a lot of fun to make and I haven't made those treats in such a long time. It was a lot of fun. And just, you know, reminded me of my grandma. But anyway, so, um, I made that. So those are in the freezer. Um, let the kiddo have the last marshmallow and then today um, I'm just gonna be doing some last-minute stuff I have to um, top off uh, fill up my uh, seven-day pillow box things at least for the days that I'm going to be gone. I'm trying to see my list, but I don't have my glasses on. Um, oh, I have to run to Five Below. Because I'm 
because I want to try to find a dashboard form of it. I have, I have the one that connects in the vent and I like it. It works. But I want to try something a little bit different as I'm driving. I'm going to run to five below after my kiddo is done with speech and PT this morning. And I need to get um, I need to get the phone mount and then I need to get um, a eyeliner pencil sharpener um because I don't know where mine is and I keep buying them and I keep losing them I don't know where they keep ending up or if I just keep losing them when I'm taking them places so I'm gonna get another eyeliner <laughs> sharpener and then I might get a thing of sponges just to have a few more um And then maybe some travel noms and then I'm done with like shopping stuff. Here's the look. Green with gold on the inside. I like it. So I've got okay, so today I have to fill up these. Well, just have to fill in Monday, um, which I'm going to do in a minute. Um, Peanut has speech and PT. I have to find the dashboard phone thing and a couple of things at five below. I'm filming the final countdown videos. Um, might visit my mom. I got to text her and see what's going on. And then tomorrow. Keep filming this vlog because I made the sweet treat yesterday. Um, and then Thursday, actually, I might move shower to tomorrow. Um, because I plan on getting up like before my husband leaves for work so I can prep. To make sure I have everything. Um, so, oh, and I have to clean the car, weather permitting. I wanted to wash my car. It's supposed to rain today. It might rain tomorrow. So, we shall see. <laughs> so, Thursday, um, I at least want to get the inside cleaned out. And then load up my stuff, get dressed and look cute, um, top off my gas tank, and get caffeinated and hit the road. I have my spending money here in an envelope on the desk, so I don't spend it, I don't touch it. Um, and then I think that's it. So, um, yeah, not really much to do except wait impatiently for Thursday to get here. Okay, this is the test Whoa. of my new holder. Whoa, I love it! You love it? Yeah. So, let me adjust the position because it's not going to work right here on the mirror. Yeah. Try over here, maybe? <clears throat> Alright. Ooh. Mm. Give me a little... Nope, that's not gonna work either. Fudge! Should've got something that stuck to the dashboard, not the window. Ugh. But I don't think I can take it back. <clears throat> Fudge! 
Fudge. Fudge! I'll have to play around with it another day. It's not gonna work for this trip. <laughs> but, even if that's a bust, I'm only out five bucks. But I picked up a few essentials from Five Below, and now we are going to get lunch and head home. Hey, Peanut, what would you like for lunch, my dear? Do you want, well, first, where do you want to go? Wendy's or McDonald's? McDonald's. McDonald's? Okay. Uh -huh. And then, do you want nuggets or a sandwich? Nuggets? Okay. You're making this real easy. <laughs> oh, hey, that movie theater closed. There used to be a movie theater. It's all closed up. Closed up? Yeah. Oh, no. I know, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, there's a movie theater by us still. And we, we might be able to go one day. Okay. I'm going to take you to go see the new Minions movie. Minions movie? Yeah. Hey, when Mommy gets back from her trip, okay. maybe we'll plan a day with Auntie V and Ava. Yeah. And we'll go to the movies with them. Yeah. Would you like that? Yes, we, we're going to have some popcorn. Yeah, we'll have some popcorn. But Mommy's got to get home, get through her trip and save up a little bit of money. And then we can do that, okay? Okay. One of the things I picked up at Five Below was some Pez and a Pez dispenser for myself. I haven't had Pez since like high school. And I thought, eh, it would make a fun little treat for the road. Yeah, Alright, my love, I have to put your cup back in your cup holder okay. so I have room for my pop. What do you see? A wire. A water? No, a wire. A ladder. Oh! Why? Yeah, up on the building? Yeah, it's like everything. Well, there's a gate on the ladder right now, so nobody can go up it. Yeah, Only certain people can go up there to fix the roof. Yeah. Come home, have some lunch. Mommy's going to completely repack all of her stuff. On Thursday, today's only Tuesday, sweetheart. I still have today, tomorrow, and then Thursday. And even then, I can't go until Daddy gets home from work. Because I can't leave you at home all by yourself, right? Yeah. <laughs> gotta keep little squirt safe. So we gotta get home, and then we'll eat. And you can go play, and mommy is going to pack again. Okay, so I have what I need. I think I have the last of my list. There's one thing I have to find at home that I know I bought, I just never used, but I need to find it. And then, uh, yeah, so... We are on our way back home, we'll have lunch, and I guess I will record again when I am repacking my suitcase. Hello, it's Thursday morning. I don't know what happened to the last clip that I know I recorded. Um, 
of that video, but I was just doing a rough cut and realized that I didn't have a closeout. <laughs> and all my curlers are coming out, so I figure I would do that while I am taking these rollers out of my hair. I'm just waiting. Um, it's only like quarter after six in the morning and I want to vacuum out my car but our shop vac is very loud so I'm gonna wait a little bit until it's later in the morning so I'm not waking up all my neighbors also I gotta do it in the garage because it's raining uh, I don't know what happened to the last clip that I know I recorded to close out the, the video but um, here it is now here's your replacement and um, the next time you see me is uh, whatever I managed to catch over the course of the trip. So I'll start it off in a few hours when I'm getting all glammed up. And then um, we'll hit the road. So I look forward to taking y'all on this adventure with me. It's going to be a lot of fun. And I'm excited to see my friends again. And I need this. I need this trip. <laughs> so, yeah. Thanks for watching, everybody. Check out the links below, and I'll talk to you later. Special thanks to Project Shadow for the use of the song Blue this time. And check out the music on their page. It is also linked below. And yeah. Talk to you later. Bye!